Welcome to New Holland's how-to series of videos. In this episode, we are going to look at how to use and store the header cutter height on New Holland combines. This allows the operator to easily adapt the cutter height according to the field conditions. You can save two auto float modes. These modes will allow the header to follow the contours of the field to maintain a consistent cutter height predefined by the operator. There is also a pressure compensation mode, which allows harvesting with a predefined pressure in the header lift cylinders. This mode enables you to cut and pick up peas or laid crops, for example. You need to engage feeding and threshing to adjust and store the desired cutting height. Subsequently, you can manually adjust the cutter height by pressing the rocker switch on the command grip multifunction handle or adjust the reel position by pressing the rocker switch on the command grip handle. To store the position, press and hold the resume button on the command grip handle for two seconds. Press the resume button once to lower the header to the stored cutting height or press twice to raise the header at headland, for example. In case you have two stored positions, you can easily toggle between both cutting heights by pressing one of the cutting height buttons on the control panel. This can be done during harvesting when field conditions change. During harvesting, you can change the cutting height or reel speed on the go by pressing the header or reel rocker switch on the command grip handle. To store this new cutting height, press and hold the resume button on the command grip handle for two seconds. This cutting height will be stored on the selected cutting height mode.